Hello everybody. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Thank you for checking out the video. Um, today we're going to be going over the fastest ways to get gold bullion and treasury notes. Um, I just want to say too, pay attention to the comments if I may have missed anything or some other great points. There's a lot of veterans that watch the channel and they do make a lot of great points in the comments. So just, you know, don't overlook the comments. There's some good uh, information there. But uh, let's get into the video. So without a doubt, the fastest way to get gold bullion is from Smiley at the Wayward. Now, unfortunately, you can only do this once a week, but it is the fastest way to get 300 gold bullion. You will have to have the main quest done, which involves the uh, which involves Crater and Foundation. Now, I didn't want to spoil too much, so that's all I'm really going to say about that. Once you have that done, you'll be able to get 300 bullion off of Smiley once a week for 6,000 caps. Definitely the fastest way to get it. Now, other than that, you can get 400 bullion every day with 40 treasury notes. So I'm going to show you the fastest ways to get treasury notes. It's not really too bad trying to get 40. It is a bit of a grind, but you can easily get 40 treasury notes a day. And I'm going to show you the best ways to do that. Again, if I miss anything, you know, let me know in the comments. But the, one of the fastest ways to get the treasury notes is to do public events. Now those are the events that appear that have an exclamation mark in the hexagon there for the event. And it will tell you that you get treasury notes. If you're, you know, not sure, just, you know, highlight it and see if it gives you treasury notes like this one does. Um, I highly recommend if you can do um, the Earl event, I forget what it's called, it will give you eight treasury notes where most of them give you two or three or even four for the queen. Um, colossal event, I forget what it is. I'm sure I'll get roasted in the comments, but definitely do that one if you can because you'll get eight treasury notes. Now, aside from events, you can also do dailies, which is the importance of communication, vital equipment, and retirement plan. Now, every 20 hours, or sorry, I notice at about 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time that these reset. So if you get one done just before 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, you might be able to get two done within a couple hours, if you understand what I mean. And uh, to do these, you're going to be going to Foundation and Crater. And they're very simple. This is probably one of the best ways if you're going to get treasury notes is just, you know, go hammer out, you know, two or three of these events. Sometimes there's two available at Crater. Um, definitely a quick way to get six or nine treasury notes. And then you already have 90 gold bullion of the 400 there. This will take about a half an hour to do all three, I would say, if that. And again, you know, the same type of daily is at Crater. Um, you can go up to Roxy. And keep in mind, you know, these are dailies, so if you've done it recently, you might not be able to do it right away. And of course, sometimes Ren is available too to get vacuum tubes. We all love those vacuum tubes, eh, eh veterans? <laughs> but yeah, that, those are probably the best ways to get treasury notes. You can also go see Davenport, but it does require a speech check, and he's at the Overseer's home. Um, it does require a speech check to get the treasury notes, if I'm not mistaken. So just keep that in mind. You may want a little bit higher charisma when you're completing this event. So yeah, you know, pretty simple. If you just stick to those, you know, events and those dailies, you should easily be able to get the 400 bullion a day. Um, at least 200, I would say, if you play for an hour or two. You might have to play longer than that to get the full 400 um, daily. Um, it used to be 200, I think, so, you know, 400 is better. <laughs> and keeping in mind, I'm going to show all the rewards, so there will be a bit of a spoiler here if you want to turn off the video now. But just keeping in mind, the higher your reputation, as I showed there, the more rewards you will get. So if you're not seeing all these rewards um, when you go to Foundation, like I am here, then it's probably because your reputation is not high enough. And these are all the rewards when you have your reputation maxed. So that's what I wanted to show as well, in case there's something you find that you may want to, like, you know, work towards. And you can also go see Mortimer at Crater. You have to go inside of Crater to go see Mortimer, whereas in uh, Foundation, he's just outside there. And, you know, this is the type of things that you get for the gold bullion. A lot of great rewards from the gold bullion. I cannot stress that enough. And like I said, if some of these rewards are not appearing when you go to these places, it's because your reputation is not high enough. 
Now there's another place too to go for gold bullion, which just involves getting the uh, main quest done. Um, there's no rep involved like I'm showing here. This is just for the raiders and the settlers, but once you do the main quest, you will be able to go to a vault and you will be able to see a person named Regs and he will give you plans as well for the gold bullion. Um, that's all I really want to say about that because like I said, I don't really want to, you know, ruin anything. You can also get gold bullion, a lot of gold bullion, uh, from doing the main quest as well and a lot of reputation. I just wanted to say too that I'm going to link a video in the description to show you how to get your rep up fast and yeah that'll help you be able to get better rewards. Um, like I said that doesn't involve this, this just involves beating the main story and like I said when you are completing that you can possibly get um, a lot of gold bullion. I'm not going to ruin that, that's your decision and when you decide to do the, uh, the main quest there. You'll see what I mean when you do it. I don't really need to explain it. I just don't want to ruin anything. And uh, yeah, he has tons of rewards here too. Like it never used to be this much, but yeah, there's a lot of rewards here. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you know, that's pretty much it for the video, everybody. Um, I uh, just want to say thank you too, like for all the support on the channel. I can't thank everyone enough. All the nice comments you guys send me, you know, like that just makes my day. It really does. And I enjoy, you know, commenting back to you as much as I can. I'm sorry if I miss your comment. I'm sure I'll get to it eventually. And uh, again, let me know in the comments if there's anything that I missed that you'd like to point out in this video. And like I said, if you're new to the game, you may want to read through the comments as well. There's a lot of good points in there, you know, that I probably may have missed in this video. So yeah, thanks again for watching everybody. I hope this helps you, you know, get your daily gold bullion and uh, yeah. Looking forward to chatting in the future, whether it's comments or on stream, everybody. Take care. Have a great day.